More than 30% of the United States population is projected to relocate by the end of 2023. This mass exodus can be attributed to several factors, but among all the states, there are 12 cities that people might be leaving drastically. Unfortunately, my city is the third one on the list. Who knows, I may be leaving soon. New York City, New York New York City is experiencing a significant loss of residents, as indicated by a recent survey conducted by Siena College Research Institute. Approximately 30% of New Yorkers intend to relocate from the state within the next five years. This trend is primarily driven by several factors, including the high cost of living, increasing crime rates, inadequate quality education, and limited opportunities. The black population has been particularly affected, with a decline of nearly 200,000 individuals over the past 20 years. Many black families are choosing to move to southern states due to advantages such as lower taxes, improved housing options, and greater economic growth. Notably, during the first quarter of 2023 alone, over 10,000 New York residents migrated to Florida. The decreasing population will undoubtedly have an impact on the city. It can affect political representation, tax revenue, cultural diversity, and social services. In order to ensure the city's continued vitality and resilience, New York City must address the issues that are driving people away and devise strategies to attract and retain residents who can positively contribute to the city's well-being. Los Angeles, California Despite being one of America's most dynamic cities, many individuals have decided that departure from crowded Los Angeles is necessary now more than ever. Recent statistics from California's Department of Finance indicate that roughly 211,000 state residents departed between July 2021 and July 2022 alone. Though an incredibly captivating territory for personal growth, diversity, culture, entertainment, landmarks, and a lot more, it remains one U.S. city that has become increasingly costly and unaffordable in terms of housing. Many locals cannot afford the skyrocketing median prices of $825,000 for purchasing a home and average monthly rent rates of $2,500, which has rendered many families homeless. As a result, many have left the city, and many are planning to leave. Moreover, the crime rate in Los Angeles continues to escalate at an alarming pace, more particularly as the notable surge in criminal activities like shootings and robberies. Statistics reveal that there were nearly 437 remorted homicides within the city in 2022, marking an approximate 50% increase since 2019. This rise in crime can be attributed to various factors, such as police reform measures, gang activity, and social unrest. Consequently, a sense of fear and unease pervades the local community. San Francisco, California San Francisco, California is a highly expensive and densely populated city in the United States. However, in recent times, many people have started leaving the city for various reasons. Projections indicate that San Francisco's population in 2023 will drop to about 715,000, marking a decline compared to previous years. The population reached its peak in 2019 at 883,305. Several factors contribute to this decrease, including high housing costs, low birth rates, natural disasters, and the impact of the COVID-19 pandemic. Ranked as the third most expensive city in the US and the seventh most expensive worldwide, San Francisco entails significant financial burdens. Renting a one-bedroom apartment in the city averages $3,642 per month, more than double the national average of $1,621. Furthermore, utilities, transportation, food, and healthcare costs surpass the national average. For instance, a basic lunchtime meal in the business district costs $21 while the gallon of gas costs $5.19. Many individuals are leaving the city in search of more affordable locations, where they can enhance their earning potential and reduce expenses. Chicago, Illinois According to data released by the National Association of Realtors, Chicago witnessed a decrease in its population from 2021 to 22, which is projected to persist in 2023. More and more individuals seeking larger homes and cost-effective options are now turning their attention towards the southern regions as their preferred relocation destinations. The leading driving force behind Chicago's outward migration is affordability, as the city's high taxes, housing prices, and utility bills significantly differ from national averages. 
Chicagoans face some of the highest property tax rates, with an average rate of 2.16% compared to other cities. The real estate prices in Illinois are above the national average, with the average home price at $275,000, which is nearly on par with Texas's median price of $215,000. This high cost of living extends beyond housing expenditures, as residents also face expensive monthly electricity bills averaging $114, in contrast to North Carolina's $88. Moreover, Chicago and struggle with job scarcity and sluggish economic growth. Between 2021 and 2022, Illinois witnessed a decrease in population size by around 141,000 people, largely due to job seekers moving to more diversified states. The crime rates and violence pose further challenges in certain parts of Chicago. The city has been labeled as one of the areas with higher homicide rates per capita, with an estimated ratio of about 24 homicides for every 100,000 residents in 2022. Boston, Massachusetts Boston, a city known for its rich history, culture, and education, has been experiencing a recent trend of population decline. Surprisingly, Massachusetts ranked seventh on the most moved from states list in 2022, with more people leaving than arriving. So what could be behind this shift? One major factor is the high cost of living. Boston is notorious for its expensive housing, taxes, and utilities. The median home price skyrocketed to $699,000 in May. 2023, making it increasingly difficult for residents to afford living there, especially after the pandemic affected job stability. The pandemic also brought about a shift in work dynamics, with remote work becoming the norm. This newfound flexibility allowed workers to choose where they live, independent of their office location. Many individuals opted to move to places with lower costs of living, better weather, or closer proximity to their families. Detroit, Michigan the exit from Detroit has been driven by various factors, with economic opportunities emerging as a key reason behind people leaving the city. According to data from Moody's Analytics, Michigan ranks 10th for outbound migration annually. Detroit has been widely known for its long-term population decline over the past years, grappling with endemic urban decay, poverty, crime, and alarmingly high unemployment rates. Another contributing factor to departure from the city is the cost of living and security issues. Recent records reveal that Detroit remains one of the most violent regions in America, with an average of over 1,900 violent crimes committed per 100,000 residents within a year. Lake Charles, Louisiana Lake Charles, Louisiana is a city that has faced multiple challenges in recent years, from natural disasters to economic downturns. According to a New York Times article, Lake Charles had the highest percentage of people who left the area in 2020 than any other metro area in the country. The article cites postal zip codes and change of address requests as indicators of the exodus. One of the main reasons why people are leaving Lake Charles is the impact of Hurricane Laura, which struck the city in August 2020 and caused widespread damage and power outages. Many residents lost their homes or had to relocate temporarily while waiting for repairs and insurance claims. Some decided not to return, preferring to avoid the risk of future hurricanes and the humidity of the region. Another reason is the lack of federal aid to rebuild the city and its infrastructure. The state has requested $3 billion from Congress to help Lake Charles recover, but the money has not been approved yet, leaving many residents frustrated and hopeless. In addition to these factors, some people are leaving Louisiana for other reasons, such as better job opportunities, closer proximity to family members, or retirement plans. According to a survey by LSU's Public Policy Research Lab, 72% of those who left Louisiana in 2019 did so for a job in another state, 12% wanted to be closer to family members in other states, and 9% left when they retired. These trends suggest that Louisiana is facing a population crisis that could affect its economy, culture, and and political representation in the future. Austin, Texas Austin, Texas has attracted many people in the past decade due to its vibrant culture, thriving tech industry, and affordable living. However, some residents are now leaving the city due to several challenges. The rising cost of housing is a major factor, with the medium home value reaching $635,000 in June 2023, after a 32.5% increase from the previous year. This makes Austin one of the most expensive housing markets in the country, making it unaffordable for many middle-class families. Rent is also high, averaging $1,800 for a one-bedroom apartment. 
Traffic congestion is another reason residents leave. The population growth has outpaced infrastructure expansion, resulting in lengthy commutes and frequent traffic jams. In 2022, Austin ranked as the 13th most congested city in the world, with drivers spending an average of 104 hours per year stuck in traffic, according to INRIX. Environmental issues are also affecting Austin, with extreme weather events such as heat waves, droughts, floods, and wildfires. In February 2021, a winter storm disrupted electricity and water supply, causing shortages that affected millions of residents. Lake Memphis, Tennessee Lake Memphis, once a popular destination for locals and tourists, has seen a decline in visitors and residents in recent years. This trend can be attributed to several factors. One significant factor is environmental deterioration. The water quality and diversity of the lake have significantly decreased due to pollution, overfishing, and invasive species. These negative changes have affected fish populations, leading to a loss of livelihood for local fishermen and limiting the overall enjoyment of fishing experiences. The occurrence of algal blooms has become more frequent, resulting in unpleasant odors and the presence of toxins that can harm both humans and animals. The Memphis Environmental Protection Agency has issued warnings about the health risks associated with swimming or drinking the lake water. Additionally, the availability of better facilities and amenities at other lakes in the area has contributed to the decline in visitors to Lake Memphis. Competing lakes such as Sardis Lake, Pickwick Lake, and Tunica Lake offer a wider range of recreational options, including water skiing, kayaking, canoeing, sailing, and abundant fishing opportunities. These lakes provide more attractive features and are more easily accessible, making them more appealing to potential visitors. Hartford City, Connecticut Hartford City has experienced a significant decline in its population in recent years, with the loss of nearly 2,000 residents. Currently, the city has just over 100,000 citizens. This population decline has had a wider regional impact, as Connecticut ranks among the states with the highest outbound migration rates, placing third worst on the list. One of the key factors driving these figures is the high taxation rates in Connecticut. Residents feel the burden compared to those in other states, as state and local taxes average about 12.6% of income. Additionally, personal income tax can reach nearly 7%, and businesses also face additional corporate taxes of around 7.5%, along with a sales tax capped at 6.35%. Connecticut is known as one of the most expensive places to live in the country, with the cost of living quote at around 27% higher than the national average. Hartford specifically has faced economic challenges due to the slow recovery from the Great Recession and ongoing effects of the COVID-19 pandemic. This has resulted in significant job losses in key sectors such as finance, insurance, manufacturing, and tourism, which are primary employment options for many locals. St. Louis, Missouri St. Louis, Missouri, a city with a rich history, culture, and sports scene has been experiencing a population decline. In 2021, the population dropped to 293,000, from 300,576 in 2020, a loss of 7,576 people, or 2.5%. Factors driving this trend include a lack of job opportunities and poor economic growth compared to other major cities, lower median household income than the national average, high crime rates and violence, and poor education quality. These issues have led residents, particularly black residents, to seek better opportunities, higher wages, safety, and quality education in other cities. Dallas, Texas Dallas is facing rapid growth, but also significant challenges, leading to high rates of people leaving. Compared to other Texan cities, Dallas has become more expensive for residents. The cost of living, including housing, transportation, groceries, utilities, and fuel, has increased. Home values have surged, with the average home price reaching $375,000 in March 2023, marking an increase of 15.4%. Renting a one-room apartment also saw a 9.6% increase to $1,250 in April of that year. Dallas has high crime rates, surpassing many other large U.S. metropolitan cities like Houston, San Antonio, and Austin. Dallas residents face various natural calamities throughout the year, including extreme heat in summers and freezing winters. They also have to deal with tornadoes, hailstorms, and other severe weather events. In February 2023, winter storms caused power grid outages and widespread water shortages, resulting in at least 21 deaths and approximately $18 billion in damages. 
And there you have it. While many people are migrating to the United States, many are choosing to avoid certain popular cities. If you are looking for a lovely and affordable city to migrate to as an expat, click on the next video on your screen. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell to get notified of our new videos.